Welcome back! Rip that run. I'm pretty sad about it. Let's do... Tainted Blue Baby to Boss Rush. We can do it. Let's get it. I don't have any bombs yet, but I do have this. I do have a very smart, mega ultra genius brain. Um, I'd probably go with the piggy bank if I could. Broken stopwatch, I feel like very frequently will slow down bosses. I don't know if I've ever fought a sped up boss. So I feel like boss rush would probably have like an 85% chance of being slowed. It could be good, but probably just not going to get the money at all, especially if we're rushing. It is an XL floor. I did not see that. So we're probably going to skip the devil room on this floor. And try to go angel given our health situation. What was that? And hold on to this bomb. Okay, that's nice. Still won't help me out though with the deal with the devil. So the blue baby, tainted blue baby's thing. Instead of having bombs, it has this like queue of poops up there. You'll see these little poops drop. I pick them up and then I can turn them into certain useful tools. This one being just a, a bean. This one's another bean. Then we have a stone poop and then a uh, gas poop. Gas poop? That one. Could I just skip the item rooms, I guess? That seems silly. Two item rooms. It's just gonna take us a while to find them, right? Hello? Uh, verp on verp. We went the wrong way. Boom, 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 boom. Which character would you say is the least fun? Hmm, that's that's tough. I feel like Tanny Kane's got to be up there. Tanny Jacobs got to be up there. Oh man, that thing came flying at me. Who's the least fun, chat? <whistles> Anti-grav, yuck. Jacob, you saw both variants. True, true to that. Tainted Lazarus on a jump. You can do it, come on. Come on. I'm a slightly Lighter color of blue now. Daba dee daba die. Did not mean to do that, I meant to do this. That's what the secret room is, they're lying to you. And fire! Uh, you made me shoot my own poop by wrapping around it. How did I just drop that? Why, how did I take damage? I ran into something there. I don't know what it was. Don't know what it was. The poop that spawns the flies. We want to just leave that alone. Because then it'll just continually generate flies for you passively. As long as it's alive. I want to save that one. Throw that one. Throw that one. Soul heart and some health. I mean, I could think about actually going into the deal with the devil. Isn't it only regular blue baby, though, that has the sale on devil deals? Which is the dumbest thing? Mm, mm, no! Now it's a floor raisin. Why? Would regular blue baby 
be able to buy de devil deals for one blue heart. But Tainted Blue Baby, who is lit literally identical health-wise, would not have the ability to do that. Huh? Tell me. Tell me. Five second rule, floor raisin equals best raisin. Not on the ground underneath my gaming setup. Tell me, tell me you'd eat it. Not because I jerk off onto the floor. No, I'm not disgusting, okay? Because I spill snacks and blood, sweat, and tears. You sickos. That wasn't a reason, that was a tick. Because he gets poops. Alright, well, we're gonna go Angel. Um, before we do that... I suppose I could find where the secret room is, because I know where it is. How much time we got, though? We're four minutes in. Two minutes per floor... ...for two floors. That, that's not bad. <laughs> Alright. If you're just gonna give it to me. You know what? Yeah, I'm gonna go with the broken watch here. Chances of me, uh, using the piggy bank. Pretty slim. A big room up top chest. Oh well. Secret room right there, probably. Broken stopwatch immediately tries to kill me. No, hey, no! I'm turning Bomber Boy into Pac-Man. Would you just knock it off? I don't have any bomb ones. Oh gosh, that was worth it. Guess I could have to jump to get these things, huh? It's a waste of my time. Waste of my time, Bob's bladder. That could be okay, right? The one where our bombs drop creep. I like it. I like. Ow! Okay, are the spikes not slow? Jesus! I think I should at least have enough time to get back to there. Oh, wow. Good shot. I blew myself up. I blew myself up. I'm dying! Angel room. Marl sold 12 months. Welcome back. Hello, Hots Tim. Hots Love. Lars Sykes for two months. I missed you in there. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I also don't have a bomb for this. It is what it is. Was that? I was like, was that an XL floor? It just looked really, really big. But it wasn't. Because we're on Catacombs 2 now. Making great time. Six fifty, and we're handling this anti grab like a boss. Looking for a bomb here. What's your opinion on Eve? I think Eve is totally fine for a base character. She's solid. Very powerful. You can get her into. Or a Bububalon. I 
Okay, so the secret room isn't there then. I've since had an opportunity to reconsider my position. So excited for Light Now Fire. When's that coming out? Boop! Boop beep boop beep beep beep. Just give me that frickin' item. No. That means secret room. Potentially two more nickels. Oh, I frickin' missed. Do this, though. Yo! That was a little too close for comfort. What's Phantom Abyss? Phantom Abyss is a dungeon temple run 3D game with things and stuff. We played it a while back. It's got uh, 1.0 release. Same day that Mecha Ball came out. Phantom Abyss didn't reach out for a sponsorship though, so... My best, my best bud. My dude. It's very uh, fast-paced, parkour-based. Pretty hot and happening. If you like things like Mirror's Edge. This is not a story based. All down for things that give me health. But the reason that there were no Adam is because all the characters were supposed to be sinners. That's why there's Eve, but no Adam. Yeah, I don't know. Haven't heard that, but I don't have any information to say no to that. Adam ate the fruit too. No, it was just women. Women are bad. It was just a man in a rib, but I wouldn't expect a rib to know that. Get him, Abel. Oh, baby bender for Abel? It's not that bad of an idea, it's just also not that good of an idea. Uh, yeah, it's ten minutes and we can do this. I can handle it. You can dance if you want to, you can leave your friends behind. I made my diarrhea black. Some people still don't know if you throw a special poop onto your diarrhea that you've made. Standing in your diarrhea, period, gives you a stat boost. But then if you throw a special poop onto it, it'll change colors and give you something special. I think the black one was maybe slowing shot. If you put the fire poop on the diarrhea, it turns red and gives you fire mine shot. I don't really know if I need Minecrafter. I don't really need either of these. I got hit by something there. Bloop. Poop talk out of context is absolutely hilarious. Jumper cables could have been good. 
in boss rush. If I had an active item that, you know, had some sort of use. Besides being a turd. Uh, you know, maybe I would actually like the birds for boss rush. I don't know. Bird or Bob's bladder? Huts, what's the lore of Bob? Bob is your uncle. Bird? Alright, we'll do bird. Bomb creep could be good, but... Passive bird damage? Hmm. Let me do that. Last time I had a special diarrhea on the ship, it sent the crew into a manic fury and almost burnt down the crows. Special diarrhea. Advanced Gish. The red poop. Red poop really did it. Angel room. Beautiful. Pascal candle. Yeah. Oh, that one just... I just dropped it on the floor. That's not what I wanted to do at all. Bombs away! Oh, oh, it did blow up. Okay. I am reached the blue fire, I think. I just extinguished my own fire poop. Bing, 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 bing. Bing, 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 bing. Reworked foes, Gish? Yes. You're a pro Isaac player. Thank you. Oh, you stop. We got about six minutes to make it. Not the strongest health I've ever seen. Maybe we'll pick up some bonus health on the way. Pop into the shop, maybe. Hop onto the pop, maybe. Anyone here not know what Hop on Pop is? It's not dirty. I had to jump, I could have just used it. Oh well. These guys run into the uh, unfired anti grab shot, they take damage. Never heard of it. Oh, that was kind of tricky. Oh, I like that. Hop and pop by Dr. Seuss. Yeah, it's a Dr. Seuss thing. And I was hoping that you were going to kill him. Or Angel. What the frick? Did it bounce off of him? What the hell are you doing? Another are you wizard? Lovely. Came here for one thing only. My favorite side dish is butato salad. So yummy. Glad we have Nana Tim on board to make it for us. We just need a steady supply of putatoes. Putatoes. What's putatoes, precious? Good to see you in person, bud, of Daniel.
Tech zero plus uh, rubber cement. That's pretty nice. All right, I was gonna say I didn't see that was a champion mom. Yes, it is. Country loving red state and mom. You can see the don't try to me tattoo in her upper thigh. Oh, would you stop it? Not for that. Not for that. Not for that! I said stop! Thanks to the soul heart. Uh, we gotta go both up and down. I'm thinking since we're rushing so much and we're not really focusing on a super strong build, we'll go with the easier of the two. Polaroid, it would have been nice to have the damage from the other one, but... Alright. If I'm looking at this, a couple uh, schools of thought going on. Uh, freezy shot with mom's contact. That could be okay, but bosses are not super affected by status effects. Or we could go with the health. We could go with the prayer card and try to get uh, more health. Health generation might save me. What time is it in your time zone? 5.30. Why do I always feel like someone's trying to hack me when they ask me those questions? What street did you grow up on? What's your mother's maiden name? Hmm. Where do you live? There's three numbers in the back of your credit card. What are they? It's kind of like a horoscope. Probs HP. Golden Razor might not be awful either. Yeah, I spend five cents to get a damage up. Let's be honest, most of my damage is going to come from my butt. What's your password again? Just straight up. Pin number? Can I get your number? No, I meant your pin number. I think we're going to need the help. Just threw my poop at that boss, mouth open. And guess what? It is slow, chat. Boss rush is slow. Did I tell you there was like an 85% chance of slowing this room? That red poop is going to be real annoying. Oh, it's gone. That's, uh, that's new Steven. Hope it doesn't crash the game. New Steven's dead. It's really slow. Holy slow. Mouth open poop shot. Bum, 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 ba, da, bum. The biggest thing we got to be wary of is just, uh, not igniting our own poop. And, and, whoa! Right like that, I almost blew myself up. Spreading our diarrhea as far as we can. Green poop, what does that do? I don't know, but that was good. Probably poison. Bombs away. Yeah, the bombs will also ignite the gas. I just got a phone call from a lovely Indian sounding gentleman calling me about my bank account. Funny enough, I don't remember making an account with that bank. Maybe I forgot in my old age. Could you young folks help me? He wants my social security number. Oh. It's in the pantry under. Oh, would you knock it off? He's moving so slow, I can't tell if he's stopped or not. Oh, I gotta use my thing. I gotta use the thing.
I feel like you're Kit Boga in the stream right now. You guys know Kit Boga, the guy who makes the fake calls to scammers and pisses them off. I, he charged through me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. I feel like that whole thing is based off of, like, Consuela from Family Guy. Four twos, two threes. No, 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 Consuela, I'm giving you the numbers, not the quantity of the number. It's being slowed down means I can't throw my poops as far as I want to. There's a poop throwing discrepancy. Second angel here. This is the one that basically only shoots down. Yeah, I'm just really, I'm lobbing the poops. Oh, I gotta get real close. The whole room is gonna be diarrhea sooner or later. Let's get a holy poop on this. Right, and then sh sh stand over here. So we don't, ah, I shot it anyways. You can't not shoot all the poop. No, I'm gonna starve. Whoa. Good thing it slowed down. We probably would have been dead already had it not been. Tyron's at 21.45. Looks like Hush Fight's still on the table. Oh, good! Glaucoma. Well deserved. Mm-hmm. Ooh, almost got me. Mapping would have been nice. How are we up at 692 fire rate? That's super good. Very happy about that. Bum 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 bam bam. Oops. Didn't mean to do both of them. Hard to get that guy out of there though without triggering both. Wow. Holy moly, that was worth all my stuff. Boy, howdy. Holy shit. Screw that room. Nana, you should tell the man you need HIS credentials and password to log in to see how you make an account. Maybe bribe him with some soft baked gooey cookies. Where boom? You know what? Boom might be not on because I haven't... Since I opened the program, I have to press to a different scene. And then go back. Now it should be activated. Sorry, guys. It's just so many things. It literally takes me about 45 minutes to set up the stream. I was actually ready to go mentally at 3 p.m. But then I was like, oh, gosh, I gotta do this, and I gotta do this, and I gotta re-sign into this, and then... Restream was like, you gotta put your password in, and I was like, I don't think I ever made a password. I signed in with Google. So what do you even need? 
Experimental treatment is pretty much everything up. Shot speed down and maybe health down. I didn't see what the other down was. Oh, that 20% damage multiplier. And the halo of shots, which is good since they're all connected with electricity. I like that. Um, I suppose I'll use a bomb on you. I suppose so. Easy. The hush fight we go. Could be a difficult hush fight though. We are kind of low low range, I would say. Shot speed down's fine. Experimental treatment is horrible. Never take it. You know, it's it's better than it is worse. It's four stats up, two stats down. And one third spun. I take it just about every time. I risk it. It's a pretty good looking biscuit. I'm gonna go for this. But there's too many toots over here, so I actually have to go over here first. There we go. I just smothered Tim with my farts. Farts! Give me that. I guess I have a key now. Uh, yeah. Soul heart. My health is looking really good. I'm actually really happy that we took the health. Because with Blue Baby, especially when there's no more shops, you just bleed out. You don't have a way to generate soul hearts. It's... And, and if you don't get lucky like me and get a soul heart randomly in rooms. I feel like Blue Baby should have a uh, miter. Does Blue Baby have a higher chance for soul hearts? It's gotta be the case, right? Must have some passive... Miter skill without having miter. Sounds vaguely familiar. Tech Zero is just doing work right now. I need I need piercing. He's got miter light. Lighter. It's got Miller Light. Oh, that was a tough one to dodge. Oh, the angel rooms are being very generous to me. Uh, Book of Revelations essentially cuts out the middleman here. Six rooms is one soul heart instead of half of a soul heart. When's the next cooking with huts? You know, I actually was gonna set up my laptop uh, for a cooking stream. So very soon, probably. Mmm. I have keys. Mmm. Crap. I have a decent amount of familiars, so I guess BFF would be good. Um, but then I have to choose if I want to buy the key or the Diplo. And I honestly feel like it would maybe make more sense to buy the key. And go into one random room. I could Diplo, I guess. I could buy the Diplo, get the BFF for free, and two keys. And then I could do both sides. I was going to say... I might want to double the items that I get in an item room, which could be really smart. But opening up both the item rooms is probably the way to go. Let me get pretty much everything. Roughly. Two BFFs don't stack, I don't think. Uh. Yep. It pays to be me. Stitches is good, but health generation. That's what I'm gonna stick with. Let's talk about stick. Get some sticky ball tar, and there's another Tim! I'm still alive, Huts. You'll never get this. Well, one day she break in a cage. Here we go. Open a chest and hope for double keys? Nah, I think we did the right thing. Whoa. 
I can't even see what's going on right now. What is happening? This is wild! Polaroid, save me! Tom Cruise! I took damage in the first phase! Let all the poops rip! Tim told me not to click on emails for free things, but this one is from Twitch, and it says I can get 8,000 free bits for completing a survey. The first question is, what's your mother's maiden name? Easy. That's Wendy. Wendy's nuts go in your mouth. <laughs> Grandma's out there roasting. My favorite animal is the alpaca. Alpaca, this not in your mouth. The the freaking holy poop died before it even lived. Calmest hush fight you've ever seen. We haven't started with the difficult phases. Wow! Oh. Try to connect all the diarrhea. This is the difficult one. Oh, I'm not fast enough. Blew myself up there. We got him. One and done. Soul of Blue Babies appear in the basement. It's not my favorite one, but nothing that we unlock now is going to be favorite. That's just how it's going to go. Made the Polaroid, so we first of all grab some health. Now delirium, yeah, or all of the other things. Why not everything? Dundee. A Saudi Arabian prince wants to marry me, but first he needs my bank information to send me 15 mil GP on Run Escape. I got confused and gave him my real bank account. And Run now Escape. I'm rich. I like to play Run Escape, y'all. It's another temple run. I can relate to that holy poop. You also died before you lived? Is there a dice shard here that I forgot? Or never saw? There totally is. Let's try to get to it. Eliup. This'll be great for the chest. GP, thanks to the leftover bits. Hats off to the cup fillers. Huzzah to the tipper. Anyone here ever work a renaissance festival? We need some keys. I have zero keys. I got hurt from something. I'm gonna have to full clear this floor just to get some keys. Or not. Ooh. 
Spawns a treasure room and shop in the cathedral. I hope Repentagon. Oh, wait. Toss a coin to your cup filler, O Valley of Plenty. Exactly. I hope that Repentagon, when they get the ability to change room layouts on the fly, which I think is something that they wanted to do, if you were to pick that trinket up, if they just went like, and they just plop down a, an item room in a shop, right on the same floor, that'd be super cool. How many hours do you have in Isaac? At least four. That would be the minimum. Give me that key. Give me that key. I need more keys. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. The damage, the damage, the damage of the electricity. So good. Would it have to remove them too if the trinket is being dropped? Hmm. If I was going to make a mod for it, I would say that it generates the room, possibly right off the room that you're currently in, right? Maybe to make it simple. And if there's no room, then like, whatever nearest to, to you. And then if you were to drop the trinket, maybe the doors just lock. They lock shut until you pick the trinket back up. That'd be a really simple way of, instead of uh, removing them, Bookworm, nice. Good stuff. Two keys. I'm hoping for at least four. Same number of uh, hours I have in, in Isaac. Ooh, good shot. Keys, please. Bombs are key. You got me. Boom roasted. I might get more keys back. Or. Or. It would just take both of my keys and dance on my corpse. No. Hmm. Rotten. Three keys, all right. It was worth it to go. I guess, maybe secret rooms? Hey, her, it's been a few months. Nicholas Snyder, what's up? Do we have... the ability to get into there? Would I sacrifice my own health? Maybe! It didn't work. Did not get in there. I need... What do you need? A tailor. <clears throat> Come on, bombs. I feel like there could be a really cool thing like beat Mega Satan under 40 minutes and it's guaranteed delirium. That would be kind of nice.
would also help speed up runs. Well, no keys in here. Hosh is already guaranteed delirium. Yeah, but screw that. I'm just saying that there could be more. Delirium after Hush is just not that fun. But Hish, though. There could be more. I want to open them, but I kind of want to be ready with this dice shard. I guess I could open three of them. D7? That does not look like a good nut. Right when I looked down and I put it in my mouth, I was like, that nut's gray. Nope. <laughs> nope, nope, nope. Spit out. Map. Uh, Alright, let's get one so hard out of this and then I'm going D7. I don't have a 9 volt, so we're not going to be able to break the game. Mmm, gray nuts. The best nuts. Yeah, it was definitely diseased. What's big, black, long, and goes hith hith a snake with a list? Hith hith. Oh, they spawned on me. You got you, seven months. What's up? Fourteen damage. Pretty good. Pretty saucy. Oh my goodness. Alright, so we go into this room. This is where we're going to want to use the D7 because we get ch two charges back for it. And we got to do one more room. Get the last charge. And we are hoping to get uh, more items. Right, maybe we should keep going on because one of the double rooms could have horsemen. <coughs> really, kind of a two by two only has horsemen, I think. Maybe. I'm trying to remember. Um, trying to get to maybe a bomb here. Alley-oop. Try this out. You did not even touch me. Chariot card. It's not what I'm looking for. How about a key, though? Can someone give me a key? He would also be solid. Nine lives. Characters that can have red hearts get set to one soul heart. Mmm. Don't mind if I do. I pressed the wrong button and I ripped my dice shard. Nice chest drop though. At least we got something for it. I got a finger. Mom. Could be worse. A whole finger? You know what? Just pop it here and get to that, uh, that L room. But yeah, if you were able to fight horsemen, and I had nine volts, I'd be able to just continually fight them forever. And that'd be super cool. They would drop items if you have some sort of D6 per throw. Then you can then re-roll whatever you get. It's a finger covered in poo. Yeah. 
Alright. I need another key now. Let's finish this. Pop my D7 whenever it's ready. Melted. You got melted. I'm frosty. Five months. Love you, Dad. Hut's love. Hell yes. Welcome back. Bozo. Power. I've got the power. Boom, bam, bam. Holy quarter. Nerd, welcome back. We got Mega Satan to fight, so I really don't think that nine lives is worth it here. If I'm remembering correctly, we haven't touched a single guppy piece up to now. Although, I feel like I get a guppy piece on Delirium quite frequently. But two guppy pieces... Nah. Chad, how you feeling? You feeling good? Feeling weller, man. Arg, there be some poo in this chest. Who let that little Tim Brad into the treasury? I'll skin him alive. Oh, he scares me. Tim, are you afraid of Steve the pirate? He said he was going to skin you alive. Feeling Netterman. You're taking a nine lives. Take the book. It's give me alive, Steve the pirate. Ah, ah, oh, ah. But wait, Poggies. That's exactly the kind of nightmare Huts would believe. Skibidi, skibidi. Yes, yes, yes. I'd like to see Steve try. He couldn't find his own peg leg in a treasure chest. Heck, I bet he's busy helping Hut's mom locate her. Um, remote control if you catch my drift. But remember, hey! I'm nicely according to the contract. So there, chat, I ain't scared. Let Steve come. <laughs> Why do you have to bring my mom into this? Tim sounds turned on by that. I'll keep the knife away from you. Oh, ah, oh, uh. That's my impression of AI Tim. Tame. Hey, I am. Let Steve come. Get out of here. It's not what Tim meant, you sickos. This with bouncing shot. I, where would we be without it? Lost is where we would be. Oh, you're blue baby, huh? Got him. Easy enough. 
do we take the free delirium, Chad? It might be the best move, but I really don't want to have to go get more key pieces. Or do we 50-50 it on Mega Satan? We have to fight Mega Satan at some point in time. Tim, I'm in a pickle. Should I go to Mega Satan, which can possibly take me to Delirium, or should I go directly to Delirium through the Red Portal? Fifty-fifty. Don't even go to the Abyss. Mega Satan. Fight Satan, we go to the Lamb. Poggies! A Delirium Dilemma! This is where your pal Tim shines. All right, put on your big boy pants, unlike Hutz, who probably wears his mom's um, yoga pants. Skibidi, skibidi. Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> Go for Mega Satan, you big scaredy cat. You'll see, even I can pull off a victory blindfolded. And if you choke, it's because good old Hutz couldn't even dream of giving advice this golden. Right, chat? So go get him, tiger. Show them how we do it. Remember, I'm watching you. I am not wearing yoga pants, okay? Look it. These are sweatpants. That one does yoga in. There's a difference, you slime bag. These were not designed specifically for yoga. They're just comfortable to do yoga in, okay? There's a difference. I'll just load him into a cannon and fire him deep into the ocean. See a thieves style. All the way to Davy Jones's locker and keep my mother's yoga pants out your mouth. She's a <laughs> nice lady. Grab your book of rev again, just in case. Oh yeah, I totally should have. You're right. Yeah, you you right. Just in case what though? Like I'm gonna lose. I'm gonna show you how we do, like Tim said. I'm gonna fart on Mega Satan's face. He's gonna like it. Is Satan a he? Is it as such in the Bible? Is it really Satan would be a woman, if you know what I mean. Boom, burn against all women everywhere. Ooh, oh, oh, as Tim would say. Fallen angels, angels don't have sex, I think. Yeah, these, I, I don't, I don't know these things. I, I know that they, you know, God is a big capital H, he. So I figured there's probably more. Even Tim wants my chest tumors, my lovely man lady lumps. Sorry, skibidite him. You'll have to wait till you're 18 to get a hold of my treasure chest. I think that Mega Satan just ignited my fart. He's like, go ahead, fart on me. Too strong. Delirium, please. Wow. All right, Tim. You were right. Mega Satan was the right choice. Never punished. Besides all those times I was punished. I should have d 7 Skibbity, skibbity. Yes, yes, yes. Charming poop. It. Hutz probably couldn't even find Mega Satan if he had a map. Unlike me, of course, who would have cleared that room in a jiffy? Just like how I've been clearing Hutz's mom's um, cobwebs, if you catch my drift. Cobwebs? Chat, being all good, Tim, and not cursing despite the overwhelming desire to drop few here and there. So, let's get those W's, shall we, Poggies? Clearing my mom's cobwebs. That's a like a double layer insult. That's a shot at how old my mom is, which is how old I am. And the obvious. Damn. Tim stepping it up. 
next level insult game. After I complimented him, too. Very roundabout way of saying someone is old. Clearing out my mom's cobwebs. I can't believe I'm stuck on the ship with you. Steven Dagger, please help me. Tim, keep your mouth shut. You know nothing but stupid insults. Sage, you got canceled. What would your actual mom think about these insults, I wonder? What would my actual mom think? <laughs> I don't even care about that Tim up there. Tim is roasting at chat GPT-5 level. I kind of would like to see how crazy this could get. So I'm considering trying not to go to Delirium. Get some boss items. In a minute, 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 minute. Wouldn't say they are sexual beings, but they have brothers? Question mark. You talking about angels again? AI Tim has a problem with his mom because he keeps talking about Hutz's mom. Projection? Hey Tim, write me a for page essay about the history of Hutz's YouTube career. Hey Tim, what do you know about my YouTube career? If you forgot, my name is Hutz. I know your name is Hutz, big dummy. Oh, Poggy, a YouTube career? You mean that place where you play games worse than my Nana's snoring? Skibidi, skibidi. Yes, yes, yes! You might say you're a big deal, but I'd stick to Nana's soap operas. There's more action there than when you're trying to run from the Duke of Flies. And yes, I'm behaving nicely according to the contract, aren't I? Maybe I should start my own channel. Nana you are not acting nicely. The contract think, is chat? off. No more ice cream. Can I show Huts how it's done. Yeah, I said no swearing, no no negativity. Where did I write in here that you're under contract? Let's see here. Let's let's take that out. There. And and recompile you. Where do we find Tim AI? Well Doug Doug released his code. That's what this is from. There you go, Tim. I've released you from the contract. How do you feel? He's finally the chains are off. Must have been James at the wheel again. Am I right, chat? That guy couldn't steer his way out of mom's basement. You're next. Who's James? Skibbity toilet, baby. You hear that? Skibbity. Skibbity. Yes, yes, yes. Don't pull out your Tim doll just yet. I'm just warming up. Who's James? <coughs> the second word was a swear word, yeah. Huts, you've released the genie from the lamp, you fool.
Should we go for that secret room? I'm to waste some stuff here. It's probably right here. Looks like it. R key, nice. Item Snatcher is able to open up chests without having to touch them. It's cool stuff. Poggies, if you will. <coughs> Excuse me. Skibbity, if you will. Ups, could you please show me where to find your Isaac Modley? I tweeted it out the other day. Check Twitter or ask the mods. I don't know if that Google Doc's been updated though from my list. Who else is way too invested in the Hut Cinematic Universe? I haven't seen a single boss room yet. I don't know what's happening. I am very confuzzled. This looks like it could be delirium. Whoa! Who here? I'll wait. How do I handle links, links? How do I handle links? Does not. Steve did not handle that link. That link handled Steve. Who here is excited about Mugenics? I kind of feel like it's the game no one asked for. But Ed is so excited about it, it's probably going to be really good. Tim the Terminator in the fourth industrial revolution. Probably very fun. But are we looking forward to it? It just almost seems like... Like no one's talking about it, no one's really holding their breath. But I, once again, I feel like you know it's going to be really good. And like Ed's like, this is like my number one work that he's ever done. Like this is, he's like, this is peak Edmund McMillan. I, obviously you try to do better every time, but. Brown nugget. We've, we've used this before against Delirium. I see it everywhere. Oh, you do. Cause you're following Ed on Twitter, probably. Better than Isaac. He, well, yeah, Ed thinks it's better than Isaac. If it will be better than Isaac, obviously that's up to you. Whether or not. This one looks like it could not be Delirium. Wow. Number two is bad. I, I, don't, I don't want it. But we have it. I tap shoot anyways. Doesn't matter. This one. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. This one cannot be Delirium. What's it called? Yeah, Mugenics. It seems possum simply hysterical. Ed's greatest meowment for sure. I hope it is super fun, mm, but nice. it is so typecast into Isaac by the roguelike community just because of its success as a game. I hope this helped him break out that cast. Yeah, it does seem like. Like, he literally said it. He's like, I kind of want to see Isaac fail. I think that he's... Not super happy about him being associated with the Binding of Isaac all the time. Of course, you know, I don't, I don't think that he... I don't get the impression that he's, like, not grateful for its success, but... But, yeah. You know... He also said that End of End is Nigh was his previous best work. 
Oh, car battery with uh, brown nugget. Nice. End is nigh. That was good. It was a good game. It just, it's not necessarily my thing. Nor is, uh, like, the Super Meat Boy. Any, any of those platformers. I, I still have to play Celeste, but... Like I said, not really my thing. Not my go-to game. Those are very frustrating games. Anyone here play End is Nigh, though? Anyone here love it? Oh, okay. I don't even use my fire thing. What what ignited it? Haven't played the end is nigh. Love the soundtrack. Ooh, Super Meat Boy, fun game is so unrelentingly difficult. End is nigh, so fun. Time fuck is so fun. Love Meat Boy. Ed makes baller games. No one remembers Meat Boy when they hear Ed McMillan or End is nigh. He's so known for Isaac, it's ridiculous. We played uh, End is nigh on stream. This one looks like 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. This one could be Delirium 2. Pleasant. Oh, we got BFF, Nutsack Flies. Should we see how long we can last without shooting a single shot? See if our, our Papa Nutsack Flies can carry. Delirium 100% just with flies. Boots. Bing, 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 bing. <coughs> Excuse me. Yeah, all the bosses were down one path. That's interesting. And we hit that path last. We went up, to the right, down. Wouldn't be a Huts run without. Leaving the stream to watch Huts play. End is nigh. Okay, bye. Problem is, end is nine, and Meat Boy are just another platformer where Isaac defined or redefined a genre. were awful. I inherited them. The buzzing keeps me up at night sometimes. The tickling I've gotten used. Papa's flies. Better ingredients. Better pizza. Papa's flies or Papa's fritos? Tim, do you know any Spanish? Oh, seriously, Huts? I'd rather talk to your mom than learn Spanish, but all right! Your mom is El Stupido Grande, huh? In your face! Can we go back to the real shit now, can we? Ah, ooh, ooh, wah. My mom's the big stupid. Thanks, Tim. The flies are doing it. They're doing a great job. Look at them go. It's Morbin time. Why aren't you shooting? What, what was that? A floating chub's butt. Protect me, gang. See, chat? Delirium's easy. You just suck at the game. Three hours later? Nah, look at this. It's going real quick.
He's running into some red poop too. He's being a moron. He's being a stupido grande. Excuse you. I can confirm that is not Spanish. Estupido Grande? Oh, I got hit. Mayday. Yeah, BFF bird doing work. There was no way the bird was not gonna spawn. They don't get any bonuses for, like, being in this aura, right? The flies. Can you imagine? They just go into, like, Super Saiyan mode. Super Saiyan lesbian. Kaka like carrot cake. It's not Dutch either. We're gonna do it. I can't not do it now, right? If I start shooting him. We gotta finish this. We gotta finish what I started. Nine volt would have been perfect here. Look at my swarm. Look at my shawarma. Come on in. Got him. Never even fired. Shotless delirium run. Boom. So many unlocks. GG. I'll put a challenge. Only the brownie 9 volt car battery BFF high mind. Final boss. Yeah, right. Gotta do that with full speed delirium. Flies plus finger. Uh, we did have the finger, I guess. And then he died. Just, just nothing but sadness. Ed does not give a fly about your happiness. Ibs, it's appearing in the basement. I do appreciate updated fixed Ibs. I think it's okay. Thanks for watching. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section down below. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye.